In this video we're going to do a stabbing exercise, which we've never done before. For the first test we're going to use what they call a tanto tipped blade. Very strong and we're going to see what kind of penetration we get with a downward stabbing motion on the lens. So let's give it a try. So it put a nick on the plastic, but really no penetration. We'll pop the lens out in a second to see what happens, but let's try it again in a different spot. You can see on this one, the knife glanced off to the side a little bit, but still no penetration. Let's try a different knife. This blade has a pointier tip. Let's see if that different blade geometry gets us better penetration. Once again, no real penetration. We'll try again and see if I can really get it to stick. Okay, let's pop the lens out. You can see a little bit of deformation, but no penetration. Let's try the helmet shell. We'll pick a thick spot. Uh, if someone, someone were battling with the dog, perhaps they would be stabbing down towards the top. Maybe they were aiming for the eyes, but perhaps they missed. So let's give this a try. Obviously, a little bit of penetration, but certainly nowhere near going through that five millimeter thick shell. Same thing. We've got a nick in the plastic, but I'm sorry, you're, you're just not going to get through that. We'll try something else. This is a broken helmet shell from a previous destructive test. You can see how thick that plastic is on top. That's five millimeters. Okay, it's very unlikely that either one of these rather large folding pocket knives is going to get anywhere near full penetration. But Let's see what we can do with it right on the bench. Managed to hit it in the same spot. No way. Not a chance. Now obviously I'm not doing a full wind-up because that would be dangerous. I don't want to injure myself or my camera person, but we'll try it with the bench made. You can see I missed there. <laughs> okay, that was a pretty hard hit. I was stabbing. Looks like maybe maybe two or three millimeters of penetration, but no way. You're not getting through the shell and maybe with enough force you might might get through the lens but you're probably not going to get a full penetration. Of course these are shatterproof lenses. I think if we put it against a hard surface we would get penetration. So let's see what that looks like. Okay. So you can see a sharp knife with a blade profile like this bench made is going to get through but it's going to take a lot of force and you're not going to shatter the lens and you're not going to get very far in before just the thickness of the blade is going to stop it from cutting through much further than what you saw here. 
So anyway, that was an interesting test and definitely worth doing.